Yurski, what's ho, what's gonna, welcome back to the channel, my guys. Listen, man, basically, bro, we here today, man, for goodie, bros. Make sure y'all stay tuned for the whole video, no skips. Let me give y'all a little backstory, man. A NYC podcaster got hit with the Mack truck. When I say the Mack truck, for those of y'all that's not from the town, that means he got hit hard. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, somebody put him down. He got hit with the Mac, you heard? So look, we about to get into the joint, but let me give you a little backstory, bro, because this is crazy, bro. The podcaster dude who invited this other guy on here, bro, he got a video getting violated, bro. You could say S-A violated, bro. Three, I think like 10 dudes stripped him in the street, pulled his pants down, made him walk home ass, booty ball naked. Violated them, bro. First of all, you can't even come back from that till you clap one of them niggas in that video. Like, and then on top of that, I think dude right here was the dude that recorded the video and posted it. So he got the whole world knowing you was booty boy naked getting violated in the streets of New York. You know what I'm saying? So this already is a violation, bro. How you invite this man on a podcast? How you invite this man to your domain, your place of business? Anyway. That's it. That's enough backstory. Y'all don't know these niggas. So I ain't even gonna give you that much more backstory on it. That's all you need. Now let's listen. Let's watch this interaction, bro. Like I said, son end up getting hit and getting hit hard by the end of this. So keep your eyes open. <laughs> you never know when these fist of cover gonna happen. Let's go. No, nigga, three videos in, I already surpassed this nigga. Okay, so you just need to I'm working with ABC. I'm working with How am I lying? How am I lying? Everybody in Long Island knew who I was. He never knew who I was? Why the f I know what you do? You a, you an Instagram live nigga? Oh, alright, so he a Long Island nigga. Long Island is like a foreign country to me. I'm in the Bronx, bro. I'm a Bronx nigga. Like, Long Island, I rock with Queens. I know a lot of niggas in Queens, but Long Island is like further in Queens. Like, you know what I'm saying? Long Island is like Staten Island. Like, they're part of New York, but like, we don't go there. You're not outside. It's possible that he's not What the f are you talking about? And I'm not outside. What, what, what you ever do hands on besides you talking about lip sucking shit? I'm a, Ooh. I'm, I'm a civilian. I'm a, I'm, I'm a civilian guy. Oh, Zan Leno. Oh, wait, wait, wait. What's okay, you? okay. He's a civilian. I mean, he clearly a civilian. He got violated and get back. You get you get violated and don't get back. That's gonna make you. Even if you was a thug, you a civilian now. What are you talking okay, about? You know why you, you know why you was in that? I got flown you know out why? to Miami. Look, 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 look. I'm going to Cali next month. When was the last? You said you said you said you said you said, you said you said three weeks was the last time you got I'm booked for a thing, right? Nigga, I get booked every single I'm day. What do I need you for, nigga? What I need you I'm for talk. besides YouTube or whatever? We don't want to talk about this. Disclaimer, I don't know none of these niggas. I doubt either of these niggas is getting booked for goddamn two quarters rubbed together. But I could be wrong. I don't know these niggas. The trap land nigga, I definitely don't know the nigga. Vado, I don't know him either. I'm reading the title. That's the only reason why I know their names. He don't even know. What are you doing with yourself, my nigga? He don't even know. What are you doing with yourself? Now, I can never now. post a video of somebody getting violated and for a hundred bucks, I'm sitting here with the nigga. You serious? My father and my whole entire hood would never look at me the same. Are you serious right now? That's a fact. That's a fact. My, my hood will literally, bro, what? You know where I'm from? Like, bro, he right though, bro. You let me on your podcast after I posted a video of you getting violated and you a grown man. Like, nigga, you a grown man out here, bro. There's no excuse for that. Thug or not, nigga, you got to defend your honor. Shit. Number one. No, nigga, you haven't posted no video like Number that. Number one. Now, now you want to be real. Now you want to be real because, number one, he's a clout chaser. Number one, he's a clout chaser. He's a clout chaser. He posted that video, and that's why he's sitting here right now because he wanted my clout. These niggas is weird. D and then he's sitting here with the Bible talking about he ain't know who I was. These niggas are weird, though. I ain't even noticed the Bible. Nigga, do got the good book on his lap, bro. Yo, like these niggas set a scripture together before they did the, before they cut the cameras on, like cut a scripture, do a scripture, and we gonna forgive the fact that I got you violated on camera. Can we talk about that? 
Since you wanna... Why is this nigga laying on the floor like that? This nigga animated. He's slipping though, bro. Like, first of all, who's this nigga in the middle? Who's homie in the middle? He just laughing at both of these sides. I can't tell who he with. Like, if you with me, nigga, you my man's nigga, don't laugh at that nigga jokes. Don't laugh at that nigga neck. Don't laugh at that nigga. If you with me, nigga, you, you ain't with me if you laughing, if you laughing with him. Yo, why are these niggas playing with the good book like that though? I hope y'all gonna read the scripture. Bro, you know what get me tight? Like I I love entertainment, bro. I'm here to entertain y'all. That's a fact. But you know what get me tight? Nothing get me madder than a nigga pulling out a Bible. This is probably the only time he ever pulled out a Bible on his channel. And then he got his hand on a joint cursing, just being disrespectful. Like, bro, have some respect. Like, we a mama at. I know she going to see this. Matter of fact, you viral, my boy. You got knocked out. I know she saw it. Pull my phone and tell me everything. Why is she lying? You did not pull my phone and try to get me to call. You did not pull my phone first and try to get me to call. Oh, my God. Nah, nah. You got it mixed up. Are you, you serious? You gotta make Nigga, I ain't know you. Why you lying? Yo, he called. He called my phone. You know why? Because, bro, you yo, I can't be on the interview. You don't remember? You probably drunk. So I end up going to bro, patch off for a bit. Bozo, nigga, bro. Why is this that? Why is that? Why is this something I did? Anyway, oh, anyway, I gotta patch off. I gotta patch off. Listen, I'm gonna tell you right now. Matter of fact, hold up. Right? Listen, he was talking mad shit. I end up going to. I end up going to patch off. I'll end up going to bro, patch off for a bit. Nigga, bro. What the fuck is that? What is that? Why is this something I did? Anyway. Oh, anyway. He invited him to the Frank stand. He invited him to the Frank stand. Oh, shit. Oh, shit. Oh, shit. He invited that man to the Frank stand. Yo, if you from the bitty, if you from the town, bro, if you from New York, my nigga, you know. This nigga got, bro, no other words. At this point, me, 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 Yeah. At this point, you got to get the hands, bro. Once a nigga invites you to the frame stand and you from the town, you got to go to town on that nigga Joe. Mong, mong, mong. So let's see what's going to happen next, bro. Let's see what's going to happen next. Oh, he's trying to clean it up. Oh, 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 he trying to clean it up. I'm talking to him. I was talking to the nigga on the phone. I was talking to him, not you. Not you, bro. But you pussy, though, because he would him. And I ain't going to lie. If that's my man's on the phone, if I want to face out my man's and I show him the, 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 the joint and you be like, oh, suck my dick to my man's, I'm taking it like you told me suck my I got to pop off. My son not here to do it. Yo, what he said? Say S say S M D one more time. Invite me to the Frank stand one more time. Cause he already know what he gotta do. He already know. Be a real New Yorker. You know what? Vado, shout out to you. I like your energy, gang. We gotta do something. I like your energy, bro. Y'all niggas in New York, right? Yeah, we gotta do something. Nigga say, say SMD one more time. I like this energy. I went to patch off for a birthday celebration. We end up going to the same bar that Bro, this nigga got the Bible in his hand. He picked the Bible back up and still talking reckless. Bunch of nothing, but still talking reckless. Ben, his girl and her friends was at. Ben left his girl in the bar by herself. I wasn't even there for Ben. His girl came up to me like, Coco, why are you here? I said, yo, I'm with my niggas. So you talking all that touch shit like Ben pulled up to my crib and all I'm this shit. That niggas, I'm niggas, are do, niggas are doing, niggas are doing, niggas, niggas are doing, niggas are doing Ben's I'm bad. Up. Now, uh, I, I, me and Ben was arguing on the internet. I knew he's you ass, right? I knew he's ass. So what I do? I, I, what I do? I, what I do? What's that called? I baited him. Oh, you trying to act tough for the internet? So you pulled up to a crib that I'm not even at. Niggas could have spanked you. Niggas know exactly where his is at. Ben ain't no street nigga. Bro, you just said you not a street nigga. If y'all rewind back, that nigga said, I'm a civilian. But then he keep talking tough like you want to get you want to get hurt. The only reason why I let you rock and we left it alone, you know why? Yes. You left it alone. You 
let me rock? You let me rock? Oh, you sure you let me rock? I'm about to rock your jaw, nigga. Oh, so, the only reason why niggas left you, left you alone and left you rock, you know why? Because if me and you go at it, somebody gonna die. On my soul. Oh, he, yo, that nigga went gangster, nigga. Nigga say, on my soul. On my soul, somebody gonna die. Yo, he talking crazy. I ain't even gonna lie. I thought it was a civilian. See that again, boy. The nigga still got the Bible in his hand. It's more to it. That's why I let you rock. Gonna let me so die. leave it alone. Somebody gonna die? Yes, sir. Somebody gonna die? So, on your soul? Know, I've been doing this for four years, y'all. How many years? Everybody who has ever put a hand. Oh my! <laughs> Yo, nigga knocked him into the rapture. Bro, nigga knocked him into the rapture. Knock that boy straight into the Book of Matthews, bro. Knock that boy. Bro, the nigga had the Bible in his hand. I know my scripture, nigga. Nah. Nah. Yo, and who is this nigga in the middle with? Yo, I said early on, I can't tell who the nigga in the middle with. Who is the nigga in the middle with, bro? He can't be with the host, because if you with the host, they're supposed to jump this nigga. He was supposed to jump on this nigga, start stomping that nigga out while he was on the floor. He must just be a mid a middleman, bro. Like, I don't know. Maybe he was just a mediator. Like, he know they got static, so he just dared to be there. But, nigga, you being there didn't help. Son still got hit with the Mack truck. Son still got hit with the Mack truck. He still got him call his insurance agent. God damn it. Bros. Bro, if you're not a gangster, bro, you can't be talking tough like that. Somebody going to die, this and that, like SMD. Uh, uh. Bro, this nigga wanted that, bro. Yo, I'm off this nasty gang. I ain't got too much more to say about that. <laughs> Bro, nigga got hit with a knuckle sandwich. Yo, remember in the movies, the bullies, but I'm going to give you a knuckle sandwich. That was a knuckle sandwich. Not even a knuckle sandwich, a knuckle sandwich. Bros, I'm gone, man. Tap in, like the video, share with your folks, man. Make sure... You tap into the lives. We go live every night. I'm gone, gangy. This bitch, she always want me at the crib. At the crib. I just come through, drop off dick and weed and chill. We just chill. Tonight, oh, Haney, I ain't even pop a pill. <laughs> Leave them perks. Back out that nigga front to split that nigga with. I love the smoke. I burn that nigga like a fish. Smoking up.